In this video, we're going to be looking at editing our WordPress posts even further. In the first couple of videos, we looked at how we actually add and create a post. And then we also looked at how to insert an image into a post. And in this video, we're actually going to now insert a video into our post. So I'm going to close this. We're now going to go back. This is our dashboard. So we've logged into our WordPress blog and we've got our original post. I'm now going to edit it again. And this time I want to actually add a video. So I come down, I start reading through and it says we will add an image on this video. We could even post a video in here as well. Something we'll cover in later videos. So I'm now going to take this out because we're actually going to do it now. I'm going to come down and we've got some information. Let's now click down and I'm going to put, okay, so I put here we could even include a video into our post. Really cool. So I actually want to post a video in here. Now there's a number of ways of doing this. There's different plugins that WordPress gives you where you can actually post video snippet codes and all sorts and it will do it automatically for you. It will improve the upload insert bit we've got from here. I could just link to a video so I could put here, um, we could include a link to our video. If we choose this one here which says add video on a standard blog installation of WordPress. So if I wanted to add it from a URL, say YouTube for example, I could go to YouTube, find the URL which is the top of my screen. I bring it down for you just to show you. Here's a video we have on YouTube. I could highlight this URL, copy, back into my blog, put the URL and the title here and insert it into post. But that will then just give a link. I actually want to show the video. So the way we can do that here is if we go to YouTube again and we find the video that we have, one thing down here, if you look, it says embeds. It says get video embed code. So if we click on this, it creates what's called an iframe and we can choose how big we want the video. So in our case, uh, the video has been uploaded. We could do a full size format here, but I just want a 640 by 390 video. I'm going to highlight the video. We go, and the way you do this, the code here, you just left click and highlight, drag left click and hold the left click mouse button down, drag all the way over it, right click and choose copy. So just to show that again, we left click at the end, hold down our left mouse button and drag it all the way across. Right click, copy. We go back to our blog. So we're now back at our blog after we've, we've got our code. We've gone back to the blog. Now, the important part here is before you paste this code, at the moment, when we've been adding content, we've been doing it in the visual. So we've been seeing what you see is what you get. Because when we've copied from YouTube, we've got code. And you can see because it's in brackets here, it's actually code. We must go into HTML, so it's the grayed out option here. And if we scroll down to where we've got, here we could even include a video. Go down here. Now we right click and we paste. It's now put in that code and if I go back to the visual side. So now when we look at our visual of our post, we can see there's a black screen here. That's where it's inserted the video for us. If we now go and view the post, so we're viewing the post, we scroll down, and here you can see now, there's the image we did in previous videos, and here's our video. We've actually inserted, if I push play, and it starts playing our video for us. So now we've really improved the look of our site by adding images, and also by adding videos into our posts. And it's just as simple as going into edit, choosing HTML, finding the part where we want to insert and then actually pasting into our blog post the video that we want to show and that's it thanks for watching